friends, welcome back to Echo Kids. I'm just sitting here enjoying my lemonade. Mm. Oh, that's good. That is refreshing. Did you know lemons make a lemonade? <laughs> God must like really love me to give me lemons. They are just this beautiful yellow fruit of the tree and man, do they taste good. I bet you God loves lemons. Do you know who God loves more than even lemons? Or dare I say it, lemonade? You, that's right. God loves you more than anything. And that reminds me of this month's memory verse. So let's review along with our super cool Echo Kids values. Yo, yo, what up fam? This is my bro, Nate. Yo, and this is my sister, Sam. We're here to give you the kids Echo Values. Remix edition, what, 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 what? What, 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 what? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, yeah. We got, we got them helping hands. Hands that help, we use them to serve. We got listening ears, what? Listening ears, what? What, what? I will listen more than I speak. What speak? From my mouth? I've got a kind mouth. I will use it to encourage and lift up others. I got a humble heart, humble heart, always putting others first. And a positive attitude, because I will always choose joy. What? I will always choose joy. What? Always choose joy. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, friends, I am here with my buddy Jocelyn, Hi. and we want to help you with this month's memory verse. Here we go. Ready? Nothing at all can ever separate us from God's love. Mm-hmm. Romans 8, 39. Let's do it again. We'll do it a little bit slower. Ready? Here we go. Nothing at all can ever separate us from God's love. Romans 8, 39. Good job, friends. <laughs> See ya. Wow, nothing at all ever can separate me from God's love. Oh, that's incredible. God loves me so, so much. Even when I'm sad, even when I'm scared, even when I'm excited. <laughs> God loves me all the time. Nothing ever can take his love away. And that, my friends, makes me want to sing and dance. So get up on those cutesy little feet. Yes, let's wave our arms in the air and let's sing this new worship song all about how God made you special and loves you perfectly. Let's go.
God loves us And he gave his only son He is awesome, Jesus Nothing can stop him, he's too strong Yeah, we sing it Jesus is alive, he's alive, oh yeah Everybody celebrate Jesus is alive, he's alive, oh yeah He can do anything Because he's big
job with worship. You guys are the best singers and dancers I have ever seen. For real. And God loves you so much. And he is with you all the time. He's with us every single day. And that helps us follow wherever he goes. <laughs> he is the best father. You know, today's message is about a father and a son and how he loved his son no matter what. I think we should hear more to that story. Let's go. Who, who know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. Me and you at the Wonder Clubhouse. Me and you. Oh, well, hello there, friends. I'm Kai, and as you can see, I'm cleaning up. I should be selling lemonade in the best lemonade stand with the lemoniest lemonade around. But, as you can see, our lemonade stand is missing the most important thing, the lemonade. It all started a few minutes ago when Poppy and I were getting set up. Poppy, watch out! Ah! The good news is Poppy's okay. The bad news is she spilled all the lemonade on me! I feel kind of mad, a little sad, and a little bit frustrated. We've been working so hard! Now what are we supposed to do? Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Kai. Who? Who? What's got you feeling so blue? Hi, Ollie. Poppy tripped and spilled all the lemonade on me. Now we don't have any lemonade. Kai, that is hard, it's true. I've got the perfect story for you. Just listen up, just follow me through. Who? Who? Oh, hi friends, I'm Justin the Mailman. Look at this postcard a father is sending to his son. It's got a big heart and it says, I love you. Aw, isn't that sweet? It reminds me of a story. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. Okay. So today's true story from the Bible is actually a story that Jesus told so we would know that God loves us no matter what. It's about a father and a son. One day, the son asked his dad if he could have a lot of money that his dad was saving for him to have when he was much older. The dad gave him the money. The son took the money and went far away. He spent his money on everything. He bought clothes and toys and fancy food. He kept spending his money until it was all gone. Everyone say, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh is right. All his money was gone and he was all alone. He didn't have a house or money or food. In fact, at one point, he even wanted to eat pig's food. Ugh. The son knew he had made bad choices, and he was very sorry. He wanted to go back to his dad and tell him how sorry he was. He decided to go back home. When his dad saw him coming, his dad ran down the road to hug him. His dad forgave him. He loved him. Nothing could ever change that. And do you know what? God loves you the same way the father in the story loved his son. God will never, ever, ever stop loving you. He loves you no matter what. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who loves you? God loves me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who loves you? 
God loves me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. I'll see you next time. So there's your story. It's all true. God loves you no matter what. So we can love each other too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, what a great story. We are so special to God that he loves us no matter what. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! You know what? I can still love Pop even though she spilled the lemonade. We can always make more. I'm gonna go check on her now. See you guys next time, goodbye! What up, Z? What's up? <laughs> I wanna see your silliest face on the count of three. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. One, two, three. Hold it, hold it! <laughs> nice, nice. Okay, I'm gonna do one with you now, ready? One, two, three. <laughs> Good job. Today we learned all about God's love and how he loves us no matter what, right? Even when we mess up, even maybe we do something wrong, God always, always loves us. Even when we make silly faces. <laughs> yes, God's love is never ending and he is always there with us. Which reminds me of this month's memory verse. Nothing at all ever can separate us from God's love. Romans 8, 39. You wanna do it with me? Sure. Okay, let's do it all together. Ready, hands up. Nothing at all ever. Try, try again, try again. <laughs> Nothing at all ever, good, link those fingers together, can separate us. Yes, us, point to you. From God's, from God's love. love. Romans 8. Romans 8. 39. 39. Yeah, let's do one more time for those cutie kids at home. Here we go. Nothing, Nothing at all ever can separate us from God's love. love. Romans 8, 39. 30, I said 31. Oh, 39. No. 39. Romans 8, 39. Good job. Let's pray and thank God for loving us so, so much. Lord, thank you so much for being with us all the time, never leaving us and loving us through everything. Even though we mess up sometimes, we know that your love never leaves us and we are so thankful. We love you, God. In your name we pray, amen. Amen, amen, amen. <laughs> Air five. <gasps> Very nice. What up, parents? I would love for you to take your child, sit down, and ask them to make their silliest face. Make some with them. <laughs> yes, maybe do a goofy dance with them. Just connect with them being silly. And then I want you to remind them that God loves them no matter what. Remind them of a time that maybe you messed up, but you knew that God still loved you. Whether you're making silly faces, doing what's right, or maybe even when you mess up. You got this.